Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Train Sim World 2020, uh, where today we're going to be hauling aggregates, of all things, just as soon as I've gathered the uh, fibres from this plant so that I can make a house later. That's, a, that's an Atlas reference there, friends. Um, yes, we're going to be rocking the uh, uh, the GP38 and this uh, this consist of, uh, of aggregate hoppers. I wonder if I can... Can I? Oh, I can. Oh, that's jolly good news. Uh, up we go. Let's have a look. Oh, look at it. Oh, aggregated to, uh, to, to hell and back. There's a lot. Right. Okay, good. Now, down. Down is... I'd like to get down. Okay, there we go. There we go. I was just getting back down again. Uh, it's a beautiful lunchtime here in sunny California. And... Uh, uh, we're going to uh, figure out how this train works. Do stick around and we'll, we'll make it happen. Now, before we all aboard ourselves, I thought we'd, we'd just take a quick look around the joint and, uh, and see what's going on. Is that train coming? Is, it, is that train coming towards me, do we think? Do we think it's going to sound its, its horn as some kind of alarm of a don't stand there? What's going to happen now? Ah! Hey, I'm on a train. Uh, all right, well, okay, that's an adventure. Uh, oh, well, now, what can we do? Ah, uh, my objective is getting a little further away. Oh, well, this is, this is exciting. We've, we've gone off piste, and I'm the ghost twins from the Matrix. And that's, that's jolly exciting. Right, that's, uh, the, the front of the train's that way, so I've got this inaccessible. I can't get to... The uh, the locomotive to uh, to seize control, uh, but what I can do is walk along the train, which is a little bit disheartening. Although there is a uh, there is a power wagon operation car wagon power operation at the end. Yeah, it's, there's no power in it. I I can't remember what it's called, but it's a, it's one of these coaches. But it's got a uh, uh, the ability to uh, to drive the thing in there. So I'm going to see if I can take control of that. I'm not optimistic. But now we're here. I'm doing this. Uh, yeah, no, it's that uh, we've gone entirely off piste, and uh, and we're we're on a proper adventure. Oh, look, it's, it even moves when you go around the corner. That's cool. Uh, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm leaving all the doors open, obviously, for for gangway access, largely. This door is locked. Is it though? Nah, it's not. Right. How do I get? Up top, because I've not been up to the I've not been up to the the top bit before. Do you get through? It's up there. Look, right. Okay, fine. Well, we'll uh, we'll go up the little staircase, up the little staircase, and then we'll trot trot along here. Open the door. Pay dirt. I don't have permission to drive it. I don't need permission. Uh, this is Grand Theft Train. And uh, and I'm I'm about to grand theft it. Ha ha! You can't stop me turning the horn on, though, can you? No. And I'm getting points in your face. Bail switch released. Yeah. Let's uh, let's apply the bail switch. And uh, well, yeah, I can I can use everything. Uh, whether or not is this going to accomplish anything or not, I've no idea. I, I'm just gonna I'll I'll take the points. No, it's all good. Uh, what else we got here? Sander. Yeah. Yeah, we'll reverse the sander. Suck the sand back up again. Yes. Right, we do appear to have stopped. I don't think it was me that caused this. I think this is an intentional stop. Uh, regardless, we'll uh, we'll see what's what. I, I mean, has to be said, ideally, I'd, uh, I'd now hijack a train going in the opposite direction to get back and do my mission. Um... But uh, what I'm actually going to try and do is uh, is stop the train. Uh, where are we? We're in San Bruno. Ah, yeah, we are. All these people don't want to go to San Bruno. They're quite happy just to stand here. Right, let's do this. And the door, climb the steps. In we go. Sit in the engineer's chair. I am in command. Right, let's go back. I want to. I need to go back and run my service. There we go. That should do it. Break. Release. Yeah, I'm taking absolutely no prisoners. Although, is ah, hmm. Maybe because I've got the brake applied in the back 
whatnot, we're going to have some, some trouble from this. Uh, that still works. Okay, yeah. Ditch lights. Pulse, pulse the ditch lights. Pulsing. And then uh, headlights, bright front, cruising, lights, brake, independent, re release that. Mm. Yeah, well, I've got that doing what it should be. That should be us going. You're off. Your the the brakes is released here. The independent is released as well. Okay, well that should be fine. Uh, down the steps. All right, everything's normal. Yeah, totally, totally normal. And uh, I, I want to get back and and rock my GP thirty eight to pastures new. Um, and if if this train isn't going to do it, I shall just have to uh, wait for one that will allow me to uh, to matrix my way back the other way. Right, okay, up we go. Alright, now then. Let's get back in the whatnot at this end and see if uh, see if we now have control. And Hello Right. There we go. Alright, so I've uh, set set the throttle to No, Sarah's no set the throttle to brake off. Uh, automatic brake release, yes. All the handles are in places. Uh, the hep on. Let's press that. Give it some hep. Hep me one time. Uh, yep, hep off, hep on, hep off, hep on. It's a hep on, hep off service. Headlights to bright. And uh, the manual crossing light is pressed. Uh, obviously, we'll get that down. Uh, that way, people can't see me. Yeah, I seal myself in here somehow. Uh, horn. Yeah, it's, it's all good, but I think, uh, I think I've... I've uh, I've come unstuck. Oh, we'll turn the bell on. Obviously. What do they do? Is that the aircon? Because aircon's important. Power handle slot. Oh, up. Reverse handle into forwards. Right. Automatic brake is released. Throttle up to six. Go on. This would be wonderful. If this, if this decided to play ball now, I'd be very very happy I'm not very happy all right I'm gonna I'm gonna go run down the track I don't care how long it takes I'm I'm going back it's only two miles it's, it's not gonna take much longer than all day all right there we go and if uh, if I happen upon a train uh, that uh, that is going the other way then I'll uh, I'll uh, I'll catch a lift otherwise I'm running it's gonna take a while but uh, but I'm running and hopefully the uh, the train that I'm actually supposed to be driving uh, doesn't have to go through the, the station there because I've monkeyed with all those controls quite significantly and therefore it's going to have a little bit of trouble um, getting out of the way. Nice to see they've lowered the safety barriers because they know I'm crossing. Very astute. I'd have done that as well. Nothing but red lights as far as this lot is concerned. But uh, but that's okay. I live on the edge. Pretty sure I'm not going to get failed for passing a red light at danger uh, if I'm just running down the track. I am, of course, running down uh, the middle of the track just in case I happen upon another train. Because uh, then it should scoop me up since uh, I am the ghost twins from the Matrix uh, reloaded. Yes. It might lack the subtlety and nuance of your modern Banksy, uh, but I think it's still uh, still quite the comment on uh, on modern society in a uh, in a grain mill of some kind that said whoever said banksy was subtle or nuanced no banksy's about as subtle as a baseball bat to the head uh but uh but hey what do you know now i've got a choice here is i could cross over to the uh to the right hand side there and take this corner on the inside thus shaving uh several yards off my overall journey but no, I'm staying on this, uh, what I'm assuming is this mainline bit. Well, I mean, it's got signals on it, so presumably that's the case. Uh, in the hope that someone picks me up and I don't have to run the second mile of this odyssey. Doesn't look promising. Still got the happy message in the top left-hand corner there, which is optimistically saying, uh, climb, climb aboard. Go on, go and sit in the engineer's seat. What are you, what are you waiting for? And I'm going. Well, I'm I'm a couple of miles up the road, mate. I I, uh, I inadvertently attempted to hijack a train. Didn't let me, but uh, but that was an adventure nonetheless. And now I've got to walk all the way back again.
You know what, there's billboards in this. You know what, this billboard should have, it should say, Colonel Failure. And then if we wanted to make it more immersive, it should say, Colonel Failure's Fried Chicken. It's mind-numbingly good. Mm, no, that's a, that's a little bit derivative. I think we'd have to come up with a better marketing slogan for our uh, f fried poultry products. Um, reconstituted bird meat. Allegedly. Choo-choo, everybody. Hello, this is your captain speaking. Uh, today's train is me. If anybody wants to ride on me, uh, then hop aboard and I'll take you to... Well, I'm only going as far as the train up there, so... Uh, so there you go. I'm perplexing the uh, passengers. Perplexing the passengers. What a lovely thing to say. Well, that's nice. You should try it for yourself. It's, it's really quite nice to wrap your face around. Um, anyway, we're pretty much back to, well, where we started off before I started larking about. Um, so we are going to get on board the GP38. Those who came to see the GP38, don't worry. We're, we're going to do that. Uh, I haven't gone completely do-lally and, and taken us off course. Well, any more than I've been somewhat do-lally so far. So, uh, so here it is. My initial intent was to uh, just, uh, you know, give you a quick look-see. There we go. Ooh, ah, ooh, yes. All of those noises are appropriate in this case. Can I go check it out? Crossing, closed, crossing, open, crossing, closed. And, uh, uh here, yeah, mm -hmm. ah, ooh, and, and, isn't it, though? Now, I could, I could interfere with stuff. Just get on with it. Stop, you know, you, you, you stopped being amusing some time ago. All right, okay, fine. And then where's the uh, where's the access hatch? Oh, this looks like an access hatch. Right, we'll climb up the steps. Do, do, do. Uh, go through the door. Excuse me. And get, get my assistance. Uh, not there. Uh, we've got the uh, the second man seat there, and the second man seat. Wow, well, that makes him the third man, or her. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm a lady, so uh, so you know, they should uh, they should pay attention to that. Right, where are we? Here we go. What are we up? Set. Engine run, fuel generator, fuel pump on. Oh, really? These are the same... Uh, all right, yeah, yeah. Bang, bang, bang. I've done that. Set uh, the reverser to reverse, because we've got to do a little bit of... Uh, no, that's the throttle, dear boy. Uh, stick me handle in. Bang it in reverse. Yes, sir. Uh, set brake cut in to freight. Brake cut in to freight. I've done that. Automatic brake to release no 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 i didn't do it i didn't i i merely flirted with it i did not put the emergency brake on there we go and then the my reservoirs are filling rapidly uh, apply the throttle to get moving i would have suggested that you you possibly want to say just apply a dab of throttle because you're going to connect up to the uh, the wagons behind you you are yeah see look Oh, I clocked this. There's a, they're not attached, so we've got to go backwards a little bit. Now, if I could remember what the keys were to make the throttle go up, is it that? Oh yeah, throttle one. Uh, just, just one. One ought to do the trick. There we go. We're going to carport now. I, I wouldn't normally do this, but this looks like you know this is a view. And clunk, we have arrived. And then turn the throttle back off again. Uh, the car's coupled up, head down to the nearby unloader to deliver the aggregates. Don't we need to, like, you know, do some things with pipes and that? Uh, presumably not. Right, okay, get in here, and then what? Stop at San Francisco East Yard. Well, we can probably do that. Uh, bang that into forwards. Uh, you're off. You're idle. You are released. You are also released. Okay, right, well, the, the, we will, uh, we'll hit the alerter. Let everybody know that we're alert, and uh, well, let's roll. Two should be sufficient to get us going. It's not a particularly lengthy train, this one. Uh, we shouldn't have any trouble in uh, in getting going at, uh, at a reasonable lick. Uh, so, uh, there we go. This is us going at a, a, slow, a slow lick. Um, I, I, I should stop saying things like that. It's, uh, it's not going to lead any way positive, is it? Uh, but there we go. We're rocking and rolling and, and so forth. And all of that business. And that's good. Yeah, it is. And I tell you, I, I rarely get bored of just kind of going like, Look at the trains! 
Um, it was highlighted, highlighted in a comment in the, the last video that uh, how is it that one such as I, who has an appreciation of trains, knows so very little about how to actually use them properly? I kind of go, because I don't care about using them properly. It doesn't, doesn't bother me in the slightest. Get it right, get it wrong, doesn't matter. Is it moving? Yes. Then you're doing it right. And meanwhile, I can spend my time out here going, ha, 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 train. Um, that's, as, that's as far as my depth of interest goes. Uh, I, have, I, I have no requirement to become the most proficient simulated train driver in the known land. No, I'm quite happy just to go, moving? Yes. Moving quickly? Yes. Then we've done here. Uh, we are exceeding the speed limit, of course. Let's try not to do that. I mean, it's not a deal breaker. It never has been, but uh, but staying within within tolerance is probably uh, probably advisable, especially since I've already sunk a heck of a lot of time into uh, into what I'm doing. Right, what other buttons have we got? Oh, there's a sun visor. Oh, that's made the world a difference. Jolly good. Right, well we got round there without issue. Eleven miles an hour. I should hope so. Uh, you got the wipers. We have got another sun visor. Well, okay, that one conceivably could have some impact. Get the windows open, though, dude. There you go. I've got to hang my head out the side like some kind of train driver. Yeah, potentially. Um, and then what? Ah, that's what you came here to hear. I'll shut up. Beautiful. Right, now, I figure I've got a bit of time, so we need to get this window open as well. There you go. Get the door open while we're at it. You can have your sun visor, and uh, that should be good. Well... Uh, yeah, we got another door here, right? We can uh, we can just go for a bit of a poke about while this is while this is happening. Uh, yeah, it's good. Crossing. Yeah, we don't do no. I need low safety. Can we jump to car two? We can't jump to car two. It's not a car at this point. It's a locomotive, but uh, no, it amounts to the same thing. Uh, right. Okay. Let's get back in. Yeah, other could. I suspect there might be some possible instructions uh, heading my way. Automatic brake. Why were you telling me about the automatic brake? I did not need to know unless I did need to know about the automatic brake. Uh, EOTD, that's emergency of the day. There's always one when I'm driving. Uh, an emer call an emergency of the day emergency. Wait for it. And then you can then you can deploy your emergency when you feel like it. Right, well, we'll, we'll leave that alone. What else have we got here? There, there must be something else. There. There's the emergency cutoff. Headlight control. Single unit, intermediate unit. I haven't, I haven't actually set my running lights on. Rear headlight off. Yeah, that's fine. Where's front headlights? Front headlight. No, put it to flipping bright. Well, uh, uh, stick it a medium. I mean, it's day. So, uh, so you're presumably bright, you only need that at night. That's a guess, but it would be logical that uh, you only need to, where headlights actually confer some light on the track versus signalling that the train is in motion in a particular direction. That's my assumption anyway. Right, okay, well we're still going, look, we're doing a mighty 9.4 miles per hour, feel the speed. Uh, if we go any faster we're going to travel back in time. Uh, but, uh, but we're not going any faster, no, we're, we're abiding by the laws because we care a lot uh, right let's uh, let's give it a bit more throttle I've, I've found the throttle button now there's a, a canal of some kind I would have thought the uh, lads and lasses from need for speed slash fast and furious are going to be doing some kind of drifting race in the puddles down there later on uh, so be sure to tune in for that uh, right no keep it going come on we can't be uh, slowing down we do have a very minor uphill gradient here uh, which, given that I've got two uh, two hauling uh, hauling donkeys on the front of my consist here, they should have absolutely no problem getting up a point one incline. Come on, fellas, let's uh, you know let's look professional about this. Get it uh, get it moving. We've got five hundred yards until something happens. Stop at location. It could be that. I'm not ruling it out. I mean, uh, when, when I selected this scenario, it did say that it was a shorter one. Uh, I've managed to make it longer by going on an adventure. Now then, has someone set the switches for me uh, appropriately or uh, not? Well, we'll find out pretty quickly. I, I could look at the map or something, but uh, I mean, it's nine. 
See? Look, I know stuff. Uh, there you go. Right, so we're going we're going down there. Yep, yes we are. And uh, coming on track two as uh, as we look at it. But that's a far less... E well, no, the switch has been set correctly. Which means I can assume that this one has as well. Assume away, my friend, for it has. Uh, there we go. We've got, our, we've got our external spy camera going on here. We need to stop in 150 yards. I'll I'll put some moves towards stopping in another, oh, let's say 50 or so. Let's uh, de-throttle. Find the braking handle. Dynamic? Uh, automatic? Yeah, no, dynamic. Right, dyno brake. Set it up. Give it a bit. Give it some more. Give it more. Give it more. Break at all. Nothing happening. Automatic brake. 99% service. Yeah, we went rocking past that because this handle doesn't do anything. No. That's just there. It's not, I'll tell you how dynamic it is. It doesn't work. Right, uncouple the first three hoppers. You got it. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll do that. Yeah, come here. Just... Yep. Now, I mean, the, the comments at, at this point are now full of people explaining exactly what a dynamic brake does, of course. Um, and uh, and saying that, you know, I'd, I'd know that if I paid attention to the comments ever. I read the comments, but then just forget about them. Um, uh, is that... I assume this is the objective it means, but part of me goes, have I just parked in a way that's, that's done this perfectly? Climb over? No, I don't want to climb over. I want to uncouple them. Where's the lozenge? Ah, there we go. Uncoupled. Wait a moment. Go via location construction yard. 10-4. Would you like me to take the train with me? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to assume yes, given that that's kind of the purpose behind this endeavour, but uh, you can never be certain. It's not very far, anyway. Uh, come on, get up. Get No, can't get up there. All right, I'll go round. Right, back in a chair. Off we jolly well go. You have betrayed me. Still, the automatic brake did a brilliant job, so we'll be using that again. Uh, off we trot. Before the 0.1% uh, gradient uh, gets us upset. Do you want me to apply some brakes on those chaps or something? Uh, or do the brakes auto snap on when it's decoupled? I would suggest they probably do, but, you know, it's, it's worth checking. Uh, and... Uh, Oh, what angle have we got here? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sat just slightly ahead of ahead of things. Should we be ready to stop, maybe? Yeah, I think that's a very good idea. 50 yards to go. Automatic brake to... Oh, that's nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't need any of that. No, no, keep going. We've got another 20 yards to go, yeah. It might say that we're close enough. Are we? No. All right, keep going then. Go on, stroll on. Yes, I know, you don't like it when you kind of go, would you make your mind up? Come on, are we going? Are we not going? What's the what's the scoop here? All right, two miles per hour. Yeah, let's stick that down to idle. We'll very gently roll forwards, very gently, and give it the beans. Well, take the beans away from it. There you go. Done. What now? I have done what you have bade me do. Unload aggregate. Okay. You're going to tell me how to do that, or shall I just figure it out? Because I'm tops at figuring stuff out, you know. By unload, do you just mean uncouple it? Because I've got, I mean, just as a, you know, just a note on, the, on what's going on here. I can't climb over those sleepers. Right, look. I've 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 parked right in the middle of a set of points, yeah, and uh, and therefore if I uncouple here, there's absolutely no point in my doing so because I'm still attached to this stuff and have no means of escape. Or is this the is this a an un, a, 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 an aggregate un uh, unspooling uh, collection hopper grid? You know what I think it might be. I think it might be. I think if I pull forwards a little bit further and get the first car onto there, then there might be a button I can press. 
because at the moment it's just saying and unload the aggregate and I'm going happy to do so I mean I could just unhook the, the wagon but as mentioned we, we wouldn't go anywhere all right okay well look back up this we'll we'll see what we can figure out I'm gonna pull it a little bit further forwards we'll use the exterior camera to figure out if that's the right thing or the wrong thing I'm not entirely sure if I've got enough room to uh, to get the entire consist up the uh, up towards the buffers here so uh, so you know that's a consideration what do you mean it's a cliffhanger no, 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 no. We don't do cliffhangers in these things. No, you, you get it all done, bang it out as one video, and then move on. No, I'm afraid it's no, afraid not. No, it's a cliffhanger. Uh, this was supposed to be a 20-minute objective type deal, and uh, and I certainly uh, 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 hoovered up as much possible entertainment from it as I possibly could. So, uh, so there is more of this, quite a lot more, in fact. Um, quite, quite a lot more than I was anticipating. Certainly, you're going to have to wait for the next episode to find out exactly what happens. Now, if you're watching this when it came out, then you're going to have to wait around 24 hours to find out how it out. Now, if you're watching it after 24 hours have elapsed, then you can watch it now. And uh, and if there's any if there's any justice in the world, that will be appearing over to uh, to the whatever side of me that it, these things appear. Um, it's uh, it's it's gonna it's probably over there, but I can't rule it out being over that way because when I record these, the camera's flipped. I think. See, if I knew, then it would be quite straightforward. So you know, use your in, use your initiative. Uh, it will have appeared by now, surely, unless I I keep this uh, ex, extra piece of footage that I I like to fling your way uh, longer than it needs to be. Right, that's that's enough.